This weekend is the Olami weekend. There's a thousand Jews from all around the world. We've got the United States, Canada, Brazil, Argentina, Chile, Israel, uh, the United Kingdom, Germany, Ukraine, Russia, uh, Georgia even. All meeting up in one place in Sao Paulo. The vibe here is amazing. Meeting new people, meeting new, new ideas, really understanding what people want, what people need. We came to meet up with um, members from other communities, other students, share our, our thoughts, our experiences, our lives. I hope uh, this summit will be cre create in our hearts uh, some big hope in good future. The main event is your love. Judaism is love in time. As long as the Jew knows that he has the fire and he has the love, he can change the world. In this moment, you become, you become righteous. The whole world, because of you, is a majority of righteous. So you can put your influence in the whole world. We will never stop fighting for Jews like you to, to accomplish their mission. I give you my word that we will never cease working for you, for people like you. We have a problem. We had a series of challenges in which uh, people from all around the world who were coming to present uh, would talk about their idea for how to get more Jews engaged with Judaism. We watched some incredible students speak about what they think is the future of Judaism. Students spoke about how they are, want to create programs that encourage Jewish growth. They want to create programs that introduce Jews to one another. We came to be part of a competition. So we try to get a donation for our projects that we developed in Israel. So the winner of the challenges gets their idea funded with $50,000. So that will enable them to take their idea from, from just an idea and bring it into fruition. It's a really beautiful thing. On stage it's been nerve-wracking nerve and my hand's still shaking. <laughs> Every community was presenting their projects uh, for this challenge uh, that we're going to, I hope we're going to win. And, uh, we show our project and I hope it will be, would be the, one of the best. All of the ideas were incredible and I'm really excited to find out who wins. I think everyone wants to win because everyone, everyone, everybody wants to do something about the community and to, something to ensure the future. We want to make our project to work and be one of the biggest thing ever. We have no doubt we're going to win. It's not, a, it's not even a question. Jews are known as Orla Goim. Our mission in this life and in the earth is to bring or to bring light to all the people in the world and that is why it's important to us for continue existing not only for Jew people also for all the world now is going Shabbat soon so this Shabbat is coming and we are going to prepare and I hope it will be a great time here Shabbat experience was very meaningful not always do we get the chance to spend a uh, um, Shabbat with so so many other fellow Jews. Meeting, speaking, having conversations about Judaism, having conversations about their cultures, and seeing the ways in which we are all different, but we are all the same. Singing together, enjoying together, sharing uh, the same the same feeling, all together with so many people. It's very very intense, very powerful. <laughs> Inspiring to see all the Jews coming together from around the world. We had an incredible, incredible Havdalah ceremony. And, and the Havdalah service, of course, was amazing. We had a wonderful performance. 
Uh, lots of flashy lights. And it was really cool to just be with people from all around the world in one space sharing this experience. The atmosphere tonight was beyond inspiring to see so many people coming together with one connecting point, which is Judaism, was extremely moving for me. It was incredible. To see everybody singing together, dancing together, getting excited, having fun, uh, enjoying themselves, sharing the joy. It was, it was really, really meaningful, very touching. The, the night activities involved a, an international kind of mini World Cup in which all the different countries face off of, against each other. Today, we're gonna, we're gonna give a grand prize of $50,000 to a team. To a team that has a project designed to help connect Jews back to their amazing heritage. We've got four teams right now that are gonna come up one at a time and give their presentation. You're gonna hear these four presentations and you're gonna vote so we can keep the Jewish legacy alive. That's what we're here for. For each and every one of us to be together. And that's what we want to bring to our community. Once a month, we organize a whole Shabbos experience. So we make a short video, and the students want to talk. And who would like to help them discover the Jewish treasures hidden inside them? I believe that it's time to change the world. And this is our chance, so thank, thank you very much. And the winner is from the Middle East, the center of the world, our nation, our country, our land, Israel. I think this weekend can make a huge difference for the Jewish world, especially Jewish youth. It's going to make a huge difference because everyone's going to go back to their representative countries and spread what they learned. It's incredible. Thank you so much for this opportunity. I, can, I feel like I can speak for everyone who came here. This was wonderful. We are one nation. We need to be together. We need to live for each other. Merci, Olami. Thank you, Olami. To the band. Thank you very much. It's a great experience. Olami, go forward.